how involved are the parents with it? It sounded a moment ago like you're, uh, in a sense, trying to keep it a bit separate from the parents so the parents don't turn it into a kind of a homework assignment or aren't looking over the kid's shoulder. So say a little bit more about what yeah, your and, ideas about parent involvement is. And you also asked me at the end of the first session, how do I invite involve the parents. Yep. When I meet the parents initially, I let them know my focus is on the child in that session and some of the parents actually come into the session with their younger children because younger kids often need the support and the, you know, the encouragement of their parent. And the parent just sits, is neutral unless the child brings them in. They're like a mm -hmm. bump on a log. Mm -hmm. So I try to involve the parents as much as I can. If I you know, for example, their homework might be reading all the uh, information in my book, which is perfect for them. And uh -huh. they learn about all the tools, and they can do it on their own. I even have their own personal CD for parents. Okay. So, you know, some, some people have said that they won't see a child unless either the parent's in their own therapy or the parent is very involved in the sessions. I like to have parent involvement because it's a, like a family systems approach and you know, if mm -hmm. the parents are not involved it's really tough, but uh, my obligation is to the child. So if the parents are willing to be helped or willing to come in and be part of it, great. If they're not, that's okay too. I'll just okay. take them where they're at. Every family is different. Okay. So the idea, and also so um, often one mom said, I want to come into the sessions because I, I learn more about my daughter and I'm a better parent. Mm -hmm. So sometimes she, and I think initially she, it's hard for parents to leave their darling, precious child with the stranger. Like what mm -hmm. is going to, what's going on here? What's she sure. going to tell them? So in this case, she really wanted to feel comfortable with me and that was fine. And her daughter was able to express to her things she wasn't able to before. She has a sister with special needs and the daughter was able to tell her mom how much that impacted her. And her mom really didn't know that before. Mm -hmm. So she was able to really understand and listen. And it was very cathartic for the girl. 